There's a laundry list of possible things fishermen can find at the end of their hooks. Depending on where they cast their lines, they can reel in everything from a puny minnow to a gargantuan shark. But when a couple of Canadian fishermen were out on a lake in 2015, they didn't expect they'd find this. They'd been trying to wrangle fish on a lake in Ontario when they heard something that made them stop dead in their tracks. It was a crying noise. They knew they had to do something, but when they paddled closer to the sound, they were in shock. It was May 17, 2015 when two unnamed fishermen in southeast Canada decided to venture out on a lake near Field, Ontario for a bit of recreational fishing. Then they heard a strange sound coming from the shallows. Typically, you might expect to find a few walleye, northern pike, smallmouth bass, or whitefish swimming in these chilly waters. What these fishermen stumbled upon, however, was totally unexpected. Also, if you have not done so already, please subscribe to our channel and click that notification bell to get inspired by these animal stories every day. Now, back to the story. The sound was more of a high-pitched cry than anything else. It didn't take an expert to know that it wasn't coming from some smallmouth bass. The source of the sound was on the shore, or rather, near the shore. Just a few dozen feet from the fisherman's boat was a baby moose. He was frantically treading water, and the poor thing just couldn't gain purchase on the steep incline. His mother was unable to help. Undoubtedly, her baby was in serious trouble. Clearly, the mama moose was doing all she could to assist her baby, but her long, stick-like legs made it difficult for her to navigate the incline. But once the men approached the shore, the mother moose charged at them. Something had to be done, or the baby moose would drown. The fishermen deliberated what to do. Should they help the struggling moose and risk being hurt by the mother, or should they continue with their fishing trip? They chose the second option and set the camera down, content to put some distance between them and the mother moose's threats. We decided it was best to let nature take its course, one of the fishermen wrote online, by letting the mama help her young. They were clearly afraid that the mother moose wasn't taking too kindly to their presence. After all, moose can be pretty territorial. As the day waned and the fishermen cast their lines and reeled in whatever fish they could, they couldn't shake the image of the struggling baby moose. Had his mother been able to rescue him? Their concern for the little moose became overwhelming, and finally, an hour later, one of the fishermen wrote they went back to see the progress. When they arrived back on the scene, they were heartbroken. The mama was nowhere to be found, the man continued, but the baby moose was still whimpering and struggling to get on shore. For over an hour, the poor moose had been in a fight for his life. By the looks of it, the moose wouldn't last much longer. We noticed that the calf was extremely exhausted because he started to blow bubbles out of his nose, the fisherman wrote. Finally, it was time for them to jump into action. The fisherman pulled the boat beside the young moose, and they could see right away how terrified he was. There was no telling how long he'd been stuck before the fisherman even saw him the first time. Not only that, but his mother had seemingly abandoned him. When they were close enough, one of the fishermen reached for the little animal. Understandably unsure of who these strange humans were, he wasn't exactly receptive. Clearly, he wasn't going to make this easy for them. Eventually, the two men managed to succeed in bringing the exhausted and very scared moose aboard their boat. Then the question became, what were they supposed to do with the poor guy? Unfortunately, even with the moose out of the water, there was another potentially bigger problem. Where had the mother moose gone? Had she felt threatened by the fisherman filming her drowning baby? The heroic fisherman couldn't exactly just leave the baby moose alone. Without a mother to protect him, the little guy wasn't likely to last very long in the wild anyway, in the water or on land. As the fisherman pet the moose to try and calm him down, they noticed just how fast and frantic his heart was beating. Chances were that the moose wouldn't have made it much longer without their help. Unsure exactly what to do, the men carried the frightened moose to higher ground where he'd have solid footing again. After more than an hour in the water and being rescued by strange humans, he was certainly exhausted. 
by the time they left the scene, the baby's mother still hadn't returned, but they still held out hope she would show. It hadn't been too long since she had wandered off, so it was very possible that she was watching nearby. In the fisherman's footage, you can see the look of pure desperation on the poor baby moose's face as he struggled to reach solid ground. What would you do in this situation? Let nature run its course, or would you risk your life to step in? If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and consider sharing it with your friends and family. Thanks again, and we'll see you in the next one.